What is up my less petty pals? Welcome back to Be Less Petty TV with me, Kelly. And today is the first Tuesday of October, which means I'm gonna give you a tiny tip in hopes to help you live your life a little less petty. And today's tiny tip is plug your cell phone up across the room at bedtime, yes, or out of the room. Either way, just do not have it right next to your bed. Uh, for several reasons, there are studies about this causing cancer. I'm more talking about the quality of sleep that we get and waking up refreshed, excited for the day. It's kind of hard to do that when the first thing you grab is your phone, and that is possible when your phone is right next to your bed. But when you're getting ready to go to bed, it's hard to really get ready to rest and be in bed and sleep deeply when we're on our phone, we're scrolling, we're looking at the news, we're looking at social media, and we're involved in other things that are being processed in our brain, and then we're trying to go to sleep on top of that. Now we're just thinking of all the things we just saw. So it's a little bit easier to maybe read read a book before bed because this helps with the quality of sleep. You can read a good story or something you're interested in. It can kind of create a little drowsiness in you. You go to bed and then you wake up refreshed and ready for the day. If your phone needs to recharge, guess who else needs to recharge? You. So plug your phone up in another room or across the room and don't let it be the culprit that ruins your good night's sleep. Be less petty with your time. Okay. Be less petty with your mind. Be less petty with your blame. All that petty shit is love. Hey. Be less petty with your friends. Love first. Make a man.